वेलकम बैक टू आर एजुकेशनल सीरीज ऑन इलेक्ट्रिकल इंजीनियरिंग इन टूडेज एपिसोड वी आर गोइंग टू एक्सप्लोर एन एसेंशियल कंपोनेंट ऑफ पावर सिस्टम करंट लिमिटिंग रिएक्टर्स ज्वाइन मी एज वी अनकवर द सिग्निफिकेंस एडवांटेजेस एंड डिफरेंट अरेन्जमेंट ऑफ दीज रिएक्टर्स इन अ कॉम्प्रिहेंसिव एंड इनसाइटफुल मैनर टू बिगिन लेट्स अंडरस्टैंड द नीड फॉर करंट लिमिटिंग रिएक्टर्स इन पावर सिस्टम्स इलेक्ट्रिकल फॉल्ट सच एज शॉर्ट सर्किट्स और ओवरलोड कैन कॉज एक्सेसिव करेंट दैट डैमेजेस द स्टेबिलिटी एंड रिलायबिलिटी ऑफ द एंटायर नेटवर्क दैट्स वेयर करंट लिमिटिंग रिएक्टर्स कम इन टू प्ले अ करंट लिमिटिंग रिएक्टर इज अ डिवाइस इंसर्टेड इन टू अ पावर सिस्टम टू लिमिट द फ्लो ऑफ फॉल्ट करेंट्स ड्यूरिंग एब नॉर्मल कंडीशन बाय इम्पोजिंग इम्पेडेंस टू द फॉल्ट करेंट These reactors effectively protect sensitive equipment, minimize damage and maintain the stability of the system. But what are the advantages of employing current limiting reactors? First and foremost, current limiting reactors enhance system stability by reducing the magnitude of fault currents. By limiting the fault current level, the reactors prevent excessive stress on generators, transformers. and other electrical equipment thus extending their operational life span additionally let's explore some more advantages of current limiting reactors number 1 voltage regulation current limiting reactors assist in voltage regulation by reducing voltage transients and harmonics they ensure that voltage levels remain within acceptable limits promoting the efficient operation of electrical equipment two power quality improvement these reactors mitigate voltage sags and fluctuations caused by load variations or short circuits by maintaining stable voltage levels they enhance power quality reducing the risk of equipment malfunctions or disruptions third protection of equipment by limiting fault currents current limiting reactors safeguard equipment such as generators transformers and circuit breakers from damage they act as a vital line of defense preventing costly repairs or replacements number 4 fault current reduction when a fault occurs in the power system current limiting reactors effectively reduce the fault current level This reduction lowers the thermal and electromagnetic stresses on conductors, minimizing the risk of equipment failure. Five improved system efficiency by controlling fault currents and reducing losses. Current limiting reactors improve the overall efficiency of the power transmission and distribution system. This efficiency translates into cost savings and a more sustainable operation. Now let's delve into the different arrangements of current limiting reactors. The first arrangement we will explore is the generator reactor. Installed between the generator and the power transformer, this reactor provides several benefits. The generator reactor not only limits the fault currents originating from the generator but also improves voltage regulation by mitigating voltage transients and harmonics. Additionally, it enhances the overall dynamic stability of the system, safeguarding against disturbances and ensuring reliable power generation. Moving on to the next arrangement, we have the feeder reactor. This reactor is typically connected at the terminal of a transmission line or a feeder. The feeder reactor offers multiple advantages. such as limiting fault currents and reducing voltage fluctuations especially during large load variations or short circuits it aids in maintaining system voltage stability minimizing power losses and enhancing the overall efficiency of the power transmission process lastly we have the busbar reactor which is positioned at the busbar section of a power system The busbar reactor serves as a protective measure against short circuits and voltage disturbances within the busbar system. By limiting fault currents, it prevents equipment damage, improves power quality, 
and ensures the smooth operation of the entire network. They are connected differently for ring main system and tie bar system. As shown in the figure. And there you have it a comprehensive overview of the need, advantages and arrangements of current limiting reactors in electrical engineering. Whether it's the generator reactor, feeder reactor or bus bar reactor, each arrangement plays a crucial role in protecting equipment, enhancing system stability and maintaining the reliability of power systems. If you found this video insightful, don't forget to like, subscribe and share your thoughts in the comments below. Stay tuned for more exciting topics on electrical engineering. Until next time, keep exploring, keep learning and keep innovating.